Hello, you welcome back. This is lesson five. The objective of this lesson says, I can rename and measure with centimeter cubes. I can what? I can rename and measure with centimeter cubes. Now bring out your book, your pencil, your textbook, and your centimeter cubes because we are going to be working with them. For fluency practice, we are going to count in ones, in twos, in fives, and in tens. When my thumb is up, you count upwards. When my thumb is facing down, you count downwards. And when my thumb is like this, you stop. Are you ready? Good. Now we are going to count in ones starting at 40. Are you ready? Now let's go. 40, 41, 42, 43, stop. Now let's count downwards from 43. 43, 42, 41, 40, stop. Now let's count in twos, upwards. 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, stop. Now let's count downwards. 48, 46, 44, 42, 40, stop. Now let's count in fives. Are you ready? Good. Let's go. 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, stop. Let's count downwards from 70. 70, 65, 60, 55, 50, 45, 40, stop. Let's count the same 10 way starting at 40. Are you ready? Yes. Four tens, five tens, six tens, seven tens, stop. Good job. Next is subtraction within 20 sprints. Subtraction within 20 sprints. Now we're going to solve them together. 18 minus nine. Now you pull down your nine, you circle your nine, you touch your nine and say it out. We're going to count on from nine to 18. When you get to 18, you stop. So we say nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So what, let's count what we have together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So 18 minus nine is nine. 18 minus nine is equals to nine. The next one is 12 minus five. 12 minus five. You put down your five, you circle it and count on from five to 12. When you get to 12, you good, you stop. So let's count on five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Now let's count what we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So 12 minus five is equals to is equals to what? Good. Is equals to seven. The next activity is an application problem. Are you ready? Yes. The question says, Amy used centimeter cubes to measure the length of her books. She used eight yellow centimeter cubes and four red centimeter cubes. How many centimeter cubes long was her book? So, you will arrange your eight centimeter cubes and your four centimeter cubes. Have you done that? Go. 
good. Now let's count all the centimeter cubes together. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So Emmy's book is twelve centimeter long. Is the scissors measured correctly? Let's check. Oh yes! Yes! So we are going to circle our scissors. Good job! That was nice. Now you are going to measure the paper clip B with your centimeter cubes. What is your answer? Good! The paper clip is 3 centimeter cubes long. Now check the cubes with your centimeter ruler. Are they the same? Do you arrive at the same answer? Yes, they have the same answer as 3 centimeter long. Now we are going to measure these items using our centimeter cubes. Are you ready? Good. We have a hamburger. How many centimeter cube is the hamburger? Let's check with our centimeter cubes. One, two, three, four. So our hamburger is four centimeter long. We have a hot dog. How many centimeter long is the hot dog? Can we do that together? Yes. Now let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. So our hot dog is six centimeter long. We have bread. How many centimeter is your bread? Now let's measure the bread using our centimeter cubes. One, two, three and four. So our bread is four centimeter long. Good job. We are going to use our centimeter cube to measure the following object and we'll fill in the length of the object. First, we have an eraser. How long is our eraser? Let's check. One, two, three, four, five. Our eraser is about 5 cm cubes long. Let's measure our hair clip using our cm cubes. Are you ready? Now let's go. 1, 2, 3, 4. Our hair clip is about 4 cm cubes long. Let's measure the length of our marker using our cm cubes. Are you ready? Good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Our marker is about seven centimeter cubes long. Now we have our pen. Let's measure our pen together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So our pen is 8 cm cubes long. Our eraser is longer than our hair clip and shorter than our marker. Because our eraser is 5 cm cubes long, our hair clip is 4 cm cubes long, and our marker is 7 cm cubes long. Good job! This is where we are going to end the lesson. Hope you enjoyed the class. See you in lesson six. Bye.